This led to the creation of ARPANET in 1969. Its initial purpose was to connect researchers at different universities, allowing them to share computing resources. Think of it as the very first digital handshake between distant machines. For these computers to talk to each other, they needed a common language, a set of rules. This is where protocols like TCP IP came in. Think of TCP IP as the postal service of the internet. TCP, Transmission Control Protocol, ensures that your data is broken down into packets and reassembled correctly at the destination, while IP, Internet Protocol, handles the addressing, making sure those packets get to the right place. These foundational protocols were crucial in making a global network possible. Now, while ARPANET laid the groundwork for the Internet, it was a British scientist named Tim Berners-Lee who truly made it accessible to the masses. Working at CERN in the late 1980s, Berners-Lee envisioned a way for researchers around the world to easily share information. His solution? The World Wide Web. Berners-Lee invented the key technologies that underpin the web. HTML, the language used to create and structure web pages. HTTP, the protocol that governs how web browsers and servers exchange information and the concept of the hyperlink, those clickable links that allow you to jump seamlessly between different pages.